not just a city on the rise, I think that we're making our mark as one of the greatest cities in the world. I was born in Boston, Massachusetts. My parents moved here in 1960s, and one of the things my father taught me is if you want to do something, you come to Miami, there's an open door. The bad news is you might have to do it by yourself. One of the things I've learned is that no idea is too small, and no idea is too big. And I think we can all be incredible agents of change. It's within each of us. And what happened to me is I had retired. I had a bike accident, broke both of my arms, um, ended up walking below Metro Rail to get to physical therapy, and I discovered my life purpose. So the big idea was let's change all this underutilized, highly valuable land below Metro Rail into this incredible community asset that connects communities and really solves many problems from transportation to resiliency, sustainability, and really recreation, health, and wellness. Fortunately, I have not done this project alone. Um, hundreds of volunteers um, have joined the ranks to create a movement. I think what keeps me doing this every day as a volunteer is the great people I get to connect with every day. Mosaic came to us with this fabulous idea. We participated in a walk from the Freedom Tower to the Underline. It was people from all religions, people from throughout Miami-Dade County. And being able to walk together, march together from the Freedom Tower to the Underline to tell our stories of why we want to come together in peace is, is really sort of represents what we're all about. My husband is a former Olympic swimmer, an entrepreneur. Um, both of our kids are entrepreneurs. I'm an entrepreneur. So I think there's a theme here, which is I think that we were instilled, is if you believe you can do it, you can do it.